Hello, welcome to our channel Agla Sim Schools. In this video, we will be covering exercise 9.2 of chapter 9 Rational Numbers of class 7th NCRT textbook. This chapter is basically about rational numbers. So let's begin with exercise 9.2. So our first question is find the sum. So we have 5 by 4 plus minus 11 by 4. So we have denominator 4 and from there we have 5 minus 11. So further solving it we have minus 6 by 4 and that minus is because of that minus is in front of the bigger number that is 11. So further solving it we have minus 3 by 2. Moving further we have 5 by 3 plus 3 by 5. Now we have to convert it into the same denominator and to convert it into the same denominator we have to multiply 5 by 3 by 5 plus 3 by 5 by 3. From there we have 25 by 15 plus 9 by 15 and from there we have 34 by 15. Moving further we have minus 9 by 10 plus 22 by 15. From there again we have to convert the denominator same and to convert it same we have minus 9 by 10 and we have to multiply it by 3 plus 22 by 15 and we have to multiply it by 2. From there we have minus 27 plus 44 by 30 which is equals to 17 by 30. Moving further minus 3 by minus 11 plus 5 by 9. So to convert it into the same denominator, multiply minus 3 by 11 into 9 plus 5 by 9 into 11. So from there we have 27 by 99 plus 55 by 99 which is equals to 82 by 99. So moving further we have minus 8 by 19 plus minus 2 by 57. So again we have to make the denominator same. And from there we have minus 24 by 57 plus minus 2 by 57. So our answer is minus 26 by 57. Moving further we have minus 2 by 3 plus 0 which is very easy which is equals to minus 2 by 3. Moving further we have minus 2 1 by 3 plus 4 3 by 5. So first of all we have to convert the mixed fraction into the PQ form. And how to convert it? Multiply 3 into minus 2 which is equals to minus 6 plus 1 which is minus 7 by 3. And same 4 5 is 20 plus 3 which is equals to 23 by 5. Now make the denominator same and to do so we have minus 35 by 15 plus 69 by 15. To solve it further we have 15 as LCM and we have 34 by 15 as our answer. To convert it again into the mixed fraction we have 2 4 by 15. So moving to the next question find 7 by 24 minus 17 by 36. So first of all we have to make the denominator same and to do so we have to multiply 7 by 24 by 3 minus 17 36 into 2 which is equals to 21 by 72 minus 34 by 72. To solve it further we have minus 13 by 72 as our answer. So moving further we have 5 by 63 minus minus 6 by 21. So first of all we have to make the denominator same and to do so we have to multiply 5 by 63 by 1 and 6 by 21 by 3. So to solve it further we have 5 by 63 minus minus 18 by 63 and from there the both the sign convert it into the plus. So we have 23 by 63 as our answer. Moving further we have minus 6 by 13 minus minus 7 by 15. So again we have to make the denominator same and to solve this we have our denominator that is 195 to solve it further we have our answer that is equals to 1 by 195 moving further we have minus 2 1 by 9 minus 6 now in this first of all convert this mixed fraction into the pq form and then make the denominator same 
and to make the denominator same we have to multiply minus 19 by 9 by 1 and minus 6 by 1 by 9 so from there we have minus 19 by 9 and 54 by 9 to solve it further we have minus 73 by 9 and to make them mixed fraction we have minus 8 by 1 by 9 moving to the next question find the product of the first is 9 by 2 into minus 7 by 4 that is very simple multiply 9 into 7 that is equals to 63 and the sign is same so we put it there 2 into 4 which is equals to 8 so to convert it into mixed fraction that is minus 7 7 by 8 so the second is 3 by 10 into minus 9 now 9 3 is a 27 and the minus sign remains same so we have minus 27 by 10 and to convert into mixed fraction we have minus 2 7 by 10 moving further minus 6 by 5 into 9 by 11 now 9 6 is 54 and the minus sign remains same and 5 11 is 55 moving further we have 3 by 7 into minus 2 by 5 now 3 into 2 6 and minus sign remains same 7 5 is 35 again 3 by 11 into 2 by 5 so 3 2 is 6 and 11 5 is 55 next 3 by minus 5 into minus 5 by 3 here 5 3 is 15 and minus sign remains same and minus 5 into 3 which is equals to 15 and minus sign and minus sign cancel out and we have our answer that is 1 so our next question is find the value of minus 4 divided by 2 by 3 so we have minus 4 divided 2 by 3 and to change the divide sign into multiply we have to reciprocal the value that is 2 by 3 to 3 by 2 and from there we have the solution that is minus 6 so the next is minus 3 by 5 divided by 2 again we have to solve it in the same way we have to explain it earlier that we have to change the sign as well as we have to reciprocal the value so we have minus 3 by 10 so moving further we have minus 4 by 5 divided minus 3 so to change the sign we have to convert it into the reciprocal value and from there we have minus 4 into 1 and 5 into minus 3 from there the both the minus sign are cancel out and we have 4 by 15 as our value so moving further we have minus 1 by 8 divided 3 by 4 so from there we have to change the sign and reciprocal the value so we have minus 1 by 6 moving further we have minus 2 by 13 divided by 1 by 7 again we have to change the sign and reciprocal the value so we have minus 14 by 13 and we have to change it into the mixed fraction so we have minus 1 1 by 13 so the next is minus 7 by 12 divided minus 2 by 13 again we have to reciprocal the value and we have minus 7 into 13 by 12 into minus 2 from there both the sign are cancel out and we have 91 by 24 so we have 3 19 by 24 as our value moving further we have 3 by 13 divided by minus 4 by 65 again we have to change the sign and reciprocal the value so we have 3 into minus 5 and 4 that is equals to minus 15 by 4 and the value is minus 3 3 by 4. So this is all from this exercise. For more such informative videos keep browsing Aglasim schools. Thank you.